everyone, and welcome back to another Unfiltered Gamer board game setup video sponsored by The Game Crafter. In this video, we are going to show you the setup for the game Planet Fulcrum that plays one to four players. It takes about mm, 45 minutes to an hour for ages 12 and up. So to begin the game, we're going to go ahead and take the board and just lay it out in front of all the players so that it is within reach of everyone. Additionally, give every single player one of these player boards here that they'll place right in front of them, as well as four of these white tokens that they'll place right in the middle of their board on the purple spaces, just like so. So it shows that their alignment is neutral, and of course the other alignments is the evil side, the overlords, and the blue side, the guardians. Then, go ahead and take one of each of these tokens here, except for the pink. So you're going to get green, black, orange, and blue. Shuffle them up, and depending on the number of players, allow them to draw these tokens. And the player that gets the blue token is the first player, whereas everyone else will get one of the colors that will associate them with the space they're going to go on. There are four different areas, green, orange, the blue area here, or white, and this area here, the black area. So after that, you're going to go ahead and put these back so for instance let's just go ahead and say that our first player here got blue so this player here is going to take this little blue as well as two more of that specific color because they're going to get three of these tokens for the area they're playing on additionally they're going to choose a character and place that character in the blue starting region which says begin so go ahead and place it just like that and of course the tokens are going to be inserted into these little slots here for standy purposes after that, then e that each player is going to get three cards from this Meteor deck. And make sure you go ahead and shuffle this deck before dealing out those three cards for each player. So this player here has got his three cards, he's got his three blue cubes, and he's got his four tokens illustrating his alignment. Additionally, each player is going to get a set of cards, and each set of cards is going to have different colors for each of the locations on the board. Make sure that each set is separated and that the number three is placed up showing a number three for each of the certain colors. So this player is going to get each stack of these different color cards for each of the regions that will benefit him in some way, whether it be strength, defense, speed, intelligence, energy, or resilience. Go ahead and just place them just like this over here. Then take those tokens of the color that he, get, he or she grabbed and place them next to or on top of that specific type of thing. So for instance, resilience three, we place these three blue tokens there. Then, go ahead and take these territory control markers and place them in the spaces they say to go. So A goes with A, B goes with B, C goes with C, as well as for each color. So I'll go ahead and just place these out just like this. Over here we have G and J and H. Over here is P and N and Q, M and K and L, and finally D and E and then F. So now all the spaces that are territories on the board are controlled by these little neutral tokens so that you can see them rather easily. This is within reach so people can grab these as well as the tokens for area control for the board. Additionally, you're going to have the guardian tokens as well as the overlord tokens, which are of course front and back because there is a dark paragon, paragon who might or may or may not be um, in the game, as well as the neutral territory control. So when you take and control an area, you'll move this off and place a token on it based on what alignment you are at that specific time. And then that's pretty much it. The rest of these go with the rest of the players, and the game will begin with the first player, the person who had the blue tokens, which in this case would be this guy here, moving around the game to play the game Planet Fulcrum. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you're interested in checking out the component, components of the game, you can watch the video previously or wait for it next week where we actually go for a full playthrough of the game Planet Fulcrum, showing you the ins and outs of how to play the game and how to win, of course, where we do a full playthrough with me, Callie, and Grant, and maybe another special guest. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video where we show you the, the full playthrough of the game Fulcrum, sponsored by The Game Crafter.